local North Atlantic haddock right now. Because people want that. That's a staple of this business. At least it was a generation ago. Everybody had, everybody ate uh, haddock. I call it local. I call it North Atlantic local. Right. So not, you never know what boat that could have been landed in Portsmouth and then thrown on a truck and then into Boston. I could, you know, I, that's, that's where I go to get the fish. So um, yeah, it could have been could have been a Boston pickup, but they, they, they truck and truck things down from Canada, Maine, New Hampshire. Oh. So as long as it's nice and new, that's the main. That's all I really care about. So in the fillet of haddock, you just kind of get behind that front front dorsal on top. You get on, get your knife on top of the back because that's where the backbone is. And so you can make your incision and stay right on top of that. Shouldn't leave too much meat behind. That's what I need. I need meat yield. And then the other side is kind of the same way. Remove the fish from the ribs. Find the find the find the backbone, get on top of it. A couple of scrapes to get around the ridge. I mean the ribs. Down. And then like that down into the that's the lobster guy bait pile down there they use that so and then people don't like the skin or if they do it should be scaled but to skin the fish just kind of dig your fingernails into the back make a couple of slices grab a hold of it and pull back and saw with the uh, blade Check for bones. I feel a few hairs that I gathered. Grip. Oh, too sharp. Grip and pull and saw. Slide. Fresh haddock. Fresh fish daily. York, Baltimore, Boston. This fish has flown all over the world. Bum, bum, ba -dum. Right, let, me, let me throw this guy in there too. Look at that, almost edible. <laughs>